Hey, I'm just going to have to go ahead and keep it real, bro. This is probably going to be the most lit video I dropped this summer, bro. You guys have been waiting for it, bro. You guys know what it is. So before we go ahead and get into this video, make sure you smash that like button because, bro, you will see some banger shoes, bro. And you will see some shoes that you didn't even know that I was toting around. You feel what I'm saying? So if I was you, I'd go ahead and smash that like button. Make sure your notification box is turned on and maybe subscribe if you haven't already. And now, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the video. All right, so what's poppin' everybody? It's your man, Young Ida Costello, back again with another video. Now, this video is going to be another ha 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 banger. Wait, 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 wait. Let me go ahead and say that one last time for the people in the back that didn't understand the stuff that I just said. This video right here, this video, this video right here, eyes right here, this video that all of you guys have been waiting for, this video that you guys have been blowing my DMs up for, this video that you guys have been blowing my Twitter mentions up for, this video that you guys have been all up in my YouTube comment section, raving about, asking me about. You guys have said, yo, the back to school videos, the top fives, we need the top. Look, they're here. So without further ado, this is another ha bang. And this video is going to be my top five back to school sneakers. 2018. Now, like I've been saying, you guys spam me this 24-7, and you guys know that I can't go another summer without letting you go things. So, with this video, and you know, I, I said it in like the last video, and that video kind of started it off, but I had to make sure that I started off right. So, this video right here starts 2018 back to school week. That means shirts, pants, vintage, everything, bro. Joggers pants, bro. But goddamn t row pants, Nike pants, everything, bro. All of those will be made in videos across the whole goddamn month of july and august let's go ahead and keep it real so without further ado i know you guys want to get straight into it when it comes to this video right here my god this video right here is my top five back to school sneakers i have multiple top five back to school sneakers videos coming soon over 100 under 100 but this video right here is going to be my specific top five countdown that i will be wearing i will be telling you guys where to cop shoes if you guys don't know where to cop them in this video so without further ado sit back relax Go to McDonald's. Oh my gosh, bro. We getting hype out here, bro. We getting hype out here, bro. Are y'all as hype as I am right now? I think you are. Go ahead, bro. If you, if, bro, if you as hype as, if you, if, if, if you are as hype as I am right now, go ahead and put in the comment section down below, Nashi season. Go ahead and put, be a goat if you rep Nashi season. But without further ado, sit back, relax, go to McDonald's and get you a Whopper because we are about to get it popping. All right, so just a little fair warning. If you guys are used to this channel and you guys do know this channel, there are there will be two pair of shoes that you guys have seen before. I think there are only two pair of shoes that you guys have seen before. Everything other than that is new and everything else on the countdowns will be new also. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. All right, so for number five for my top five back to school sneakers, I have to give it to the Converse Calm De Garcon or should I say X Nashi. Now, if you guys don't know, for a lot of you new guys, this is pretty much for me, going to be like one of my main shooters for back to school this year, you feel what I'm saying? When it comes, if you guys are looking for any kind of shoe, this shoe will pretty much pop up in a lot more lists. But if you guys are looking for any other shoe that you guys can wear on a daily and wear 24 seven, this is that shoe for you. Now, you guys might see Converse and you guys might see Chuck Taylors and you guys might be like, uh, I don't really know if this is what I want. Trust me, make sure you get the Calm De Garcon ones. You can get them in this oatmeal colorway, or you can get them in a black colorway. They cost like around 100 bucks. Those bad boys will be good for you. They barely get dirty. And Converse's are the kind of shoes are like Vans, where if you get them dirty, they still look dope. They still look beautiful. And if you guys want any tips on how to wear these, bro, you can go ahead, go to H&M, get you some H&M skinny fit denim. Or if you guys want to mess with Subi, like the more expensive kind, you can do that also. Or if you guys want to go a little bit cheaper and mess with the Old Navy kind, you can do that also. And one thing that I do recommend that you guys do do if you don't mess with it, you can actually cuff these bad boys and rock the Tyler the Creator look. You feel what I'm saying? If you look at the on foot review that I would show with these, you guys will see exactly what I'm talking about. But when it comes to number five, I had to give it to the Converse CDG Nashi now. If you guys are wondering why I call it the Converse CDG Nashi, 
Um, I actually customized the shoe, so as you guys can see, there's a whole lot of writing on it. You feel what I'm saying? I think I'm going to make a whole review, another review, and like on foot review, just letting you guys know about all of that. But this is number five. I pretty much chose this shoe because it's a quick shoe that you could just put on and go with. Like I always been saying, bro, my style is changing and it's more simplistic. It's still flashy in a way, but it's more simplistic. But this is number five. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into number four. I sold for number four after giving it to the Converse X Tyler the Creator Golf LaFleur. Now when it comes to these bad boys right here, bro. When it came to the Converses, you can cop those. You can go online and search them up and you can cop them just like that. Honestly, you can go to Dover Street Market and pick those up. And I'm gonna try to put like a link in the description box just to let you know where you can pick them up. When it comes to these, I'm gonna keep it real. These will be a little bit harder, but they won't be as hard to get. When it comes to these, as far as me, cause this is my own personal one, as shoes that I will be wearing, I will be wearing these bad boys specifically because they're fire, they're clean. And to be completely honest with you, I have not worn these yet. You know what I'm saying? These bad boys are clean and it's like, they're almost, they're not hard to match with, but you just gotta have stuff in your arsenal to match with them. And that's kind of what I'm looking for for the start of this new school semester, you feel what I'm saying? Now, as you guys can see, if you guys look at the shoe, it has like this all over green suede. And that's something that I think is bootyful when it comes to these bad boys right here. And then it has like that little blue flower boy stripe going through it, which actually brings the whole shoe together. It's crazy how five and number five and number four are both Converse shoes. It, I think it's actually pretty crazy. Now, when it comes to how you guys can cop these, I recommend that you guys go to StockX or the Go app and you guys can look for different sizes of these. Now, these aren't going to hit you over the head. Now, the Converse's will cost you like a cool 120, 125 with tax. These bad boys will cost you maybe 100, 120. It might be the same kind of price. You feel what I'm saying? So, if I was you and you wanted something like this, I would go mess with them. And these aren't the only colorways that they have. When it comes to these bad boys, they drop them 24 seven. They drop here, they drop there. Uh, they're pretty much widely available. They're pretty much widely available. You just have to find them. And once you find them, you'll be able to find them for the right price. Trust me. But when it comes to number four, I had to give it to the Tyler X Converse Golf LaFleur. Definitely, I will be wearing these a whole lot, just like those uh, Carm de Garcons, you feel what I'm saying? Now, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into Number three. I sold for number three after give it to the Air Jordan 1 bread. Now these bad boys, now let's just go ahead and keep it real, bro. When it comes to finding these, bro, unless you have like a sneaker boutique in your area that gets a lot of heat, that gets a lot of traction, I'm, I'm gonna have to just go ahead and keep it real. It's going to be a little bit hard to cop these or to find these, but when it comes to me, and you feel what I'm saying, and like the Air Jordan 1s, when it comes to these, bro, these bad boys are insanely easy to wear with. That's why these are like a, a need for back to school if you can find them, you feel what I'm saying? I think that these are neat. I'm not even gonna sit here and lie to you. I'm not even gonna sit here in front, bruh. They're black and red. I'm wearing blue and orange with a red headband. If I really threw on the right pants, I could still pull these off and it wouldn't even matter. Sometimes, look, look, look I'm about to give you guys a key fashion tip right now. Sometimes not matching a little bit it's better than matching all the way. You feel what I'm saying? Take that tip in mind. Sometimes not matching just a little bit is better than matching all the way. These bad boys are extremely fire. It's for sure a nice little iconic shoe. And when it comes to these, bro, I just think that the whole quality aspect of these is fire. If you guys want a full review, go ahead and leave that in the comment section down below and I'll let you know what's up with these. But if you guys look, as you guys can see, like it is like this all black leather and then the whole goddamn toe is in this like red leather i think that that is definitely fire in my opinion and these are definitely going to be killers for back to school now if you guys want some help i can give you just a little bit of help of how you can find these bad boys if you have any sneaker boutiques in your area like how we have like three or four sneaker boutiques in your area where people will buy shoes and they maybe take it there just to get like some bucks back you feel what i'm saying if you have some of those in your area make sure that you're following your instagram and then check those out but you might be able to get those for like a deal, like a 160, 180 type of deal. But if there aren't, then your next best friends will be Go App and Stock X. And Go App and Stock X take a long time to ship. So when it comes to school, if you are a big spender and you're lollygagging, no, you better get these bad boys quick and get them to you so you can wear them on the first day. I, I know, bro. I, I know, I know how y'all look. I know, bro. I know how you little homies are. You feel what I'm saying, bro? Bro, I, I understand it, bro. Because trust me, bro. I've been there myself, bro. Look, bro. 
you go to the store probably like a week before, a week before school would start, and the mall's packed, right? And the mall's packed, and you there, you find your clothes, you find your shoes or whatever, and you sitting there, you go home the night before, the night before school starts, right, for the first day. You know, you got your nice little kicks popping. You got your whole outfit laid out on the dang chair. You feel what I'm saying? And you sitting there laying on your bed and you just looking at it like, boy, I'm about to kill these niggas tomorrow. I, I get it, bro. I understand, bro. It's happening to me all the time, right? You sitting there, your outfit laid out, the shirt laid out, pants laid out, shoes laid out right next to it. And you sitting there like, oh my God, bro, I'm about to break these necks. Keep watching these videos if you want to break some more necks because Young Nashi got you. But without further ado, these bread ones was number three. So let's go ahead and get into number two. All right, everybody, so for number two, I have to give it to the Adidas Yeezy 500 blush. Now, these bad boys are one of the newest acquirees. How do you say that, bro? I don't even know, bro. These bad boys are one of the newest sneakers that I've added to my collection. And if you guys have been following the channel for a long time, I know there will be some new people clicking on this video, bro. If you are, what's up, dog? Press that subscribe button, you need me. But if you are like, if you are, bro, if you've been, if you've been on this channel, bro, you guys know that I've wanted Yeezys for a long time. I've wanted the 350s. I've wanted the dang 700s to 750s. And when it came to the 500s, I took the opportunity and I saw those and I picked these up. And I feel like these bad boys are extremely deemly fire you feel what i'm saying bro i just said extreme ademally you feel me but, but it don't even matter bro these bad boys is crazy um a lot of people don't like these a lot of people look at these as like the old head shoes they look at these like dad shoes but i'm gonna keep it real bro if that if there is a dad style out there which i know that there is the dad the dad style fits me because my style might be different from y'all's my style right now i got so much to do so my style is get up and work 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 so it's more like adidas pants nike pants hoodies vintage hoodies stuff like that just to kind of like keep me going you feel what i'm saying so that's kind of like my style if you know what i mean so when it comes to these bad boys and my rotation these are going to fit clean on like chill days where i don't feel like dressing up much which is pretty much going to be every day i can just put these bad boys on and just chill out with them and you know i used to worry about how, what people think about what's on my feet uh, I don't really, I don't do that much anymore because, you know, you, when you grow up, you get more mature and you don't really care about stuff like that. But even if I was trying to think about stuff like that, they're, they're Yeezys on my feet. You can't say another one. I got these Yeezys on my feet. So when it comes to these, these bad boys are definitely dope. Now, if you want to cop these, like I said, if there are any sneaker boutiques in your area, you could do that. You can check those out and come in clutch, come in nice with them. Um, I did just make an unboxing for these and I got like a whole new review of these coming soon just wait on it bro i got you you feel me like wildfire and if you guys want to check these out um if there are any sneaker boutiques in your area you could be able to find them for the low low don't go over 240 but if not then you might want to have to check out the go app and stock x like i said before but without further ado this was number two let's go ahead and get into number one what's up y'all this is number one The number one shoe that I will be wearing for back to school. Let me fix myself. Excuse me. Excuse me. Let me take my top. You take my top. Okay. Let me take my top. Okay. We're good. We're good. Okay. Ah. This is number one. I hope you guys are ready for what I'm about to show you guys. I know you guys know that this video has been lit. You guys have probably been on the edge of your seat all video. And you guys are probably like, oh my God, I love this man. Let me hit that subscribe button. Go ahead, bro. What's up? Thank you. I appreciate it, bro. I love y'all. Y'all my homies. But without further ado, let me go get number one. Okay, so without further ado, the number one sneaker from my personal back to school sneakers list in 2018 is the Air Jordan 1 Shatter Backboards. Now, 
Oh my goodness gracious, great balls of fire. You dig what I'm saying? These bad boys are fire, bro. Um, when it comes to Air Jordan 1s, let's go ahead and keep it real. These might be the best Air Jordan 1s out there. They're for sure in the top three or the top five. Top three is on the top three, too. Let's go ahead and keep it real. You feel me, dog? But these bad boys are crazy. The main thing that's crazy is not even the pure, like, the colorway. The colorway is cool. The colorway gives it, like, this nice little vintage look. But the real thing that's really the killers of these is the whole quality aspect of them. You feel me? Look, this quality is like butter. This quality is insane. You feel what I'm saying? So these bad boys are extremely dope, if you know what I'm saying. Now, when it comes to wearing these... When it comes to ones, bro, just like I said with the breads, bro, you could wear these with anything, bro. It truly does not matter, bro. You can honestly put these shoes on with god dang Adidas pants. A lot of people are like, you can't wear Adidas, bro. We're not even getting into that, bro. I'm just going to say what I want to say. You can wear these with like Adidas pants, god dang Nike pants, bro. Denim shorts, bro. Basketball shorts, sweat shorts, bro. Honestly, it truly does not matter what you can like. You can wear anything with these bad boys. And when it comes to Air Jordan ones, it's weird. Something that's weird about them is that no matter what the colorway, they're super easy to match with, and that's something that I think is fire. So when it comes to my countdown list for number one, I definitely had to give it to the Air Jordan One Shattered Backboards, some definite bangers. Now when it comes to these, if you guys want to cop these, bro, like I said, if there are any sneaker boutiques in your area, that's pretty much your best bet. Now the real how to cop shoes for like cheap and expensive, all that's coming soon. But if you guys still need some help, I'll still help you, and I'm gonna say that StockX, the Go app. Flight Club will rip you off. Stadium Goods will all be your best friend. You feel what I'm saying? I will try to leave links to those in the description box down below. But without further ado, shout out Backboard Air Jordan 1s. We're number one. All right, everybody, so that was the end of this video. Hope that you guys have enjoyed. Now, this video truly starts the start of Back to School Week 2018. Are you guys excited? How did you guys enjoy this first video? Did you guys think that it was dope? Did you guys think that it was trash? Go ahead and put that in the comment section down below. Now, when it comes to my channel, I pretty much do everything, bro, from basketball videos to sneaker videos to vlogs to relationship videos with my girlfriend, you feel what I'm saying? So if you are new to this, to dang reaction videos, to gaming videos, you feel what I'm saying? So if you are new to this channel, bro, be, be prepared to god dang receive a whole lot of entertaining content you feel what i'm saying and when it comes to back to school week i got more of these coming for you because i know you guys want to be prepared i'm gonna prepare you bro i'm gonna give you the keys to freshness so without further ado all i gotta say is hey blessings 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 and uh chris out